I have been traveling for many days through the amazing panoramas of canyonlands and salt lakes. Birds scout the horizon and guide me across these roads that sometimes lead nowhere. But this route led me to the Pasangun Plateau. And in a beautiful sunrise, I discovered another Native American legend in a very special place. Bryce Canyon. Magical. Here nature again offered me a spectacular sight. One where water and ice have carved the rock in a very unique way. Ancient natural windows and chimney stones in delicate balance. And thousands of rocks that look like heads that hear the call, the hoodoos. Perched at an altitude of more than 2,000 meters, this unique canyon reminds us that the earth, with clouds drifting and dancing above, was once covered in water, an immense seabed filled with all kinds of fish. And the legend almost rings true. Before humans lived on the earth, were the people of legends, the legend people, the Towenanungwa. They were great in numbers and of all kinds. Pigs, sharks, snakes, rats, sheep, leeches, and all type of animals which, although they looked like human, were not human. They possessed a very special power to transform themselves. The legend people had the reputation of being bad people. They took more than they needed, used the resources of the land beyond what it could sustain. They consumed all of the water, ate all of the food, and left nothing behind for the rest of the animals to survive the harsh winters. Witnessing the disaster, the great coyote, master of chaos, came up with a plan. Always full of anger, coyote cast a curse on them that would turn them into stone. And we can see them today. Some standing, some seated or lying down. Others are huddled together. And you can see their faces painted red. The name of this place is Ankakuwas Awitz the faces painted red. Don't take more than what you need, says the coyote. Actually, the more we need, the sadder we are. Because we cannot have it all. Remember how we have already so much. And I remember this ancient oracle from the Apache tribe. May the sun bring you new energy by day. May the moon softly restore you by night. May the rain wash away your worries. May the breeze blow new strength into your being. And may you walk gently through the world and know its beauty all the days of your life.